Finland to a lot of people means the savage splendor and natural vistas of Lapland. But I've been to Swedish Lapland, and it's cold. I almost asphyxiated in a freezing tent with my crew. So no Lapland this trip. Instead, Lappi for the full Lapland dining experience, without all that uncomfortable camping and freezing and choking to death on fumes from your heater in an enclosed tent. But I digress. Like reindeers? I do. I like them on my plate, while Santa looks on with mute horror from the chair where he's duct taped and ball gagged. Eat here all the time? <laughs> I'm guessing this restaurant's all about reindeer. Pretty much. Well, what do you say? I say, let's get to smoke reindeer an assortment of things. Right. And then the Lapish game selection for two. That's right. Ice-cold Koskin Korva mm -hmm. to handle the finished vodka with the frozen gravel. Thank you. Yeah. Hate reindeer, by the way, they're pests. Hate Santa, too. Santa Absolutely. and reindeer. I'm a Krampus guy. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, good morning. <laughs> this is like vodka, dude. Yeah, but it's, it's made out of rye. Oh, really? Yeah. Koska and Korwa is the, uh, the national, they call it the pocket warmer, because everybody walks around with a half drunk warm bottle of Koska and Korwa with this stuff. And it's usually better when it's pocket warm. Really? <laughs> yeah. Salmon tartare, air dried reindeer, delicious cheese, reindeer carpaccio, marinated something or other, and whitefish roe. Wow, that's pretty cool looking. Mm. That's good, yeah. right? Mm -hmm. I love roe. You know? Oh, yeah. You know what? I'm thinking the fish it rode in on. Yeah. Awesome. This is really, really good. Mm -hmm. How many people live in Finland? What's the population? Five million. You, you, you held off the entire Soviet Union with, with a quarter of the population of Manhattan. Yeah. It's kind of awesome. See, so it's, it's supposedly the quality in Finland that, you know, people have over here. That, you know, no matter how hard it gets, you just don't roll over and whine. But see, so it's, it's guts and not give up and bullheadedness all rolled into one. It's an inner quality. We pride ourselves to that kind of stuff and, you know, I can drink three bottles of vodka, no problem. Or I can ski for 80 miles in freezing snow. Are these this valuable project. everyday skills? I think so. <laughs> <laughs> Braised reindeer, reindeer sausage, and a great big <laughs> hunk of roasted reindeer. Wow, that's awesome looking. Yes. Yeah, what is that? It's sauteed oh, hams and carrots. And right. Mmm, that was great. What was the sausage again? Sausage. Reindeer. Reindeer. Reindeer is delicious. Mm-hmm. It can be done in many times. It's pretty good. Mm -hmm. Come to that. Mm. Sisu and pocket warmers. The Finns need both to weather their long, piercing winters and to take part in one of the most dangerous national pastimes ever conceived. This is folk racing. Many Finns, particularly in this area, learn to drive real early, which is why some of the best Formula One drivers in the world have come from around here. Our vehicles, the hollowed out shells of seemingly barely roadworthy VW bugs. But these babies are loaded up with some seriously tweaked out engines. Great, I love it. The idea? Survive two laps on mirror ice. No snow tires or chains.
local competition, this in a place where every school kid or grandmother on the corner can drive like a bat out of hell. on ice, try to get around two laps faster than anyone else. Try not to roll your car. Avoid head-on collisions. This in a zero traction situation. turns, Sammy gets hit, spins out in front of me, suddenly coming straight at me. I could have turned the wheel half a mile back. It's already too late. Victory is no longer a possibility, to say the least. But I can settle a score with Sammy if I'm lucky. In the end, I finished second to last. Unrevenged, but undamaged. You're like a, you're a murderer out there. I could have been killed. <laughs> oh, man.